I couldn't get the fire to uh, start. All the woods are... Are you camping? Yeah. Oh. Right, so you camping? Hey, hey, it's okay. It's okay. Uh, I don't know, I'm just gonna go to the lake. Please uh, like and subscribe to the channel and uh, stay tuned for more adventures like this and many others. Hey guys, welcome to the video. Today we're doing a hike to a lake. Um, it is a nice and gorgeous sunny day today, but uh, temperatures are uh, down to freezing, around minus seven, minus eight right now. And uh, yeah, it's really cold, even though it's uh, nice and sunny. You can see, uh, we can still see a lot of uh, some of the snow that sort of left in the last couple of days. Yeah, beautiful sunny day today. So I think it will, uh, it will take about an hour, another hour for us to get to the lake right now. And uh, I think we have about uh, two to three hours left of sunlight. So we need to get a uh, move on get to the lake and set our camp. And we got to look for firewoods as well to keep us warm for the night. Because it's going to be freezing tonight and we don't want to be sleeping in the cold. So we can try and get there as quickly as we can. And uh, gather some firewoods. Hopefully there's plenty around there. But uh, I have no idea what to expect there because this is our first time going to this lake so finger crossed hopefully there's plenty of woods around and uh, yeah I'll see you guys there so I just crossed paths with like, a group of people here and they uh, they said they spot a bear around here uh, I didn't think there'd be bear around this time of year because uh, it's so cold and I thought there all be in uh, hibernation but I guess I was wrong so just gonna keep my eye out just to make sure we're good, but uh, I do have my knife and my bear spray with me for defense if anything does happen. But I'm 100% sure it will be all right. Uh, you know, bears around here are very passive and they are scared of humans. So, I mean, I've encountered a couple bears before, a few bears during my hikes over the years, and they're all very scared of humans. So, we should be all right.
All right, guys, we made it to the lake. That was, uh, the last part was pretty hard. It's all uphill, got tiring for a bit, and it was, uh, I got hot and sweaty, but here we are. We're at the lake right now. Um, Sarang, Sarang just over there. Uh, she's uh, scared to come down here. She's always scared of uh, crossing bridges. Uh, yeah, especially this one where there's uh, a lot of snow and a lot of ice right now. So she uh, she won't come down here. But uh, yeah, we're we're here at the lake. Beautiful sunny day. A lot of snow here still. Uh, might be uh, we might be getting uh, some snow tomorrow as well. But for now, we're gonna uh, we need to look for a camp spot. I think there's a lot of dead wood around here, so we can uh, we should be fine tonight with our uh, hot stove. <sighs> okay, let's go ahead and look for a camp spot, and I'll see you guys there. We found the spot. I think we're gonna camp here for the night. Uh, the, <clears throat> so the trail goes around this lake here, and I'm sure there's uh, plenty of camp spot around the, on the lake, but it's getting dark and I don't wanna risk it uh, and go looking for another spot. So we're just gonna camp here, gather some woods before it gets really dark and uh, get warm up because the sun's freeze up right now. Yeah, so I'll see you guys in a bit. <laughs> see, it's rain.
All right, guys, tents all set up. The uh, wood stove set up. That took uh, quite a while because uh, this is uh, my first time setting up this tent. It's a brand new tent. I didn't know what to do. So it took me uh, some time to figure it out, but uh, we got all we got all figured out, all right. And the stove here too as well. This is a brand new, first time using this. Uh, we don't have much daylight left, so I say maybe about an hour. So I need to go uh, find some wood before it get dark, and uh, we'll settle in and stay warm for the night. Hopefully, I can find enough wood to stay warm for the night um yeah so i'm gonna go ahead and uh let's find some wood all right hand are freezing so I gotta put on these gloves stay warm get in some woods quickly and uh, you warm up my hands because it's freezing right now okay Couldn't get the the wood stove to start. All these woods are uh, really wet, so couldn't get it to start. So I'm just gonna we're setting up our bed now. It's getting late, and then uh, gotta make dinner. Getting hungry as well. So it might be a cold night tonight, but uh, I think we'll be all fine. We'll be all right. I got our sleeping pad here. This one is uh, pretty good for winter uh, winter weather with a sleeping pad here. Uh, I got a sleeping bag that is uh, rated for minus five, so we should be all right. I also have a sleeping bag for Serang as well, <sighs> so we should be all right. Uh, my water bottle is still frozen, so I'm going to try and uh, heat, uh, use this to uh, warm up the water bottle so I can open it. Oh. Oh. 
Ooh. All right, that works. Look at that. It's all ice in there. Ooh, <clears throat> it's so cold that uh, pretty much our foods are almost frozen. Um, so this is our sleeping space here, all set up. Green bags, the, uh, got the mat, both mat, one for one for Sarang, one for myself. Sleeping bag, two sleeping bag, pillows. Uh, I'm gonna skip dinner tonight just because I uh, I brought uh, soup for dinner and I need to use some of this water for that. But I wanna save this water. I'm gonna boil this up and use it as a heater for our sleeping bag to keep us warm for the night because we can't get the fire to start. Well, this is my last try to get this fire going. <laughs> Uh, got a bunch of wood here, uh, so hopefully I can get some this fire going. So far, it's looking good so far. I think I might get it. So if I can get this going, we can stay warm for for the whole night. That'll be awesome. <laughs> but so far, it's looking good. I'm excited for this. All right. Well, I'll bring you guys back. See what happens. Uh, I couldn't get the fire to uh, start. All the woods are, all the woods is all too wet. It wouldn't keep going, so. And yeah, it's freezing cold right now. <laughs> I was hoping to get the fire going so we can have a nice warm uh, sleep tonight, but uh, that's not gonna happen. So we're just gonna rely on our sleeping bags and key, uh, and I'm just gonna boil, boil this water up and throw it in the sleeping bag. And that's just uh, keep us warm for the night. <sighs> Yeah, it's really cold right now. Everything is freezing up. My water is frozen. Um, foods are frozen. But uh, we'll be fine. Uh, that was a nice hike down to the lake. Beautiful lake. Um, yeah, the lakes was uh, partially frozen. It wasn't all frozen, but uh, the top layer. It's a thin layer of ice. But it's beautiful, quiet. No one's around here, just us. <sighs> But sadly, can't get the fire going. No big deal. We'll get the fire going next time on our next trip. But uh, yeah, this is a good stove. Uh, yeah, just don't have the dry wood to uh, start it. All these woods here are frozen and wet. So, oh well. So, so I'm gonna heat up the water and uh, let's kinda get to bed. And we'll uh, wake up early tomorrow morning. And I'll see you guys in the morning. Good night. <sighs> All frozen. <laughs> Alright, good 
morning guys it's freezing cold outside looks like the tent outside is all frozen uh floor is all frozen uh sleep last night was uh it's pretty decent it's not too bad it's actually better than uh, i expected uh with this uh this hot water trick kept my uh sleeping bags warm still nice and warm and toasty right now the only downside to that was uh we gotta, I gotta wake up at uh, every three hours just to uh, reheat the water, but uh, it's not too bad at all. So uh, yeah, we're just gonna get up, pack, uh, pack up, and uh, start hiking, hiking down. All right, guys, we're all packed up and ready uh, to hike out of here. Beautiful lake, a lot of ice, a uh, little bit of snow around here. Not too bad, but uh, during the night, we couldn't get the stove going and it was pretty cold at nighttime. But uh, I had a trick. We used a hot water trick inside of my sleeping bag, which uh, kept me warm all night long. Yeah, because without this, I would have been shivering all, all night. So this is a nice trick that I found a few uh, many years back hiking. One hike I was doing a couple, uh, two nights hike uh, at, a, at another lake and uh, it was freezing the first night. So. So I thought, uh, so the second night, I thought, okay, why don't we try and boil some water and put it in here and put our sleeping bags. 
from then on, it works like a charm, never fails. The only thing is, you gotta, oh, oh my mouse is all free. frozen. It's hard to talk right now. <laughs> but yeah, the, uh, the, only, uh, the only thing is, uh, I gotta wake up every three hours to uh, heat up the water, which isn't, uh, which isn't too bad. But it was worth it to heat up the water, keep it in the sleeping bag, keep it warm. So it works really well. So we're gonna start a hike out of here now after this. And then uh, please uh, like and subscribe to the channel and uh, stay tuned for more adventures like this and many others where we hike, camp, car, uh, car camping, and other adventures as well. So stay tuned for that. And I'll see you guys in the next adventure. Take care.